full of stories, some with twists and turns, others inspire and inform. As a journalist with ABC Action News, it's a commitment to give perspective on all angles and provide answers that are hard to find. I'm Jameson Euler, covering what's important to you. Teaming up to support local veterans tonight, we're going to hear the inspiring story of a young man now helping vets after his own veteran brother died by suicide. ABC Action News reporter Eric Waxler looks at the issues that are destroying so many families. Brant McCartney says his brother's death drives him now to help others. I grieve through telling my brother's story and having him and the man that he was catapult change. And I get to, I get to talk about my best friend and my brother every day. Brand's brother, Marine Captain Matthew Brewer, died by suicide last year. On the outside, Brewer was a football star and larger-than-life military figure. But his brother says traumatic brain injuries and PTSD led to mental illness. He was my best friend, my biggest mentor, the man I looked up to the most in life. And I never had these hard conversations about mental health with him because of our relationship and what he thought it meant to be a man and what I thought it meant to be a man. Now through a nonprofit called the 38 Challenge, McCartney is trying to destigmatize mental illness and let even the toughest people know it's okay to be vulnerable. He also says it's crucial to identify how brain injuries affect one's behavior so those veterans don't think they are simply crazy. Estimates are about 22 veterans die by suicide every single day. McCartney met with other veteran advocates at Tampa's VFW Post 4321 to share ideas and ways to reach even more vets who are struggling. One of the biggest reasons that we have for, for veteran suicide is, is isolation. And we've just created a country that is focusing on isolation. So you're seeing this compound. Miss Pinellas County Kylie Blakely is joining in too, showing you don't have to be a veteran to fight this crisis. She's using her platform to spread awareness and wants to eventually work for the VA. Over the past